a movie can have many actors in it and an actor can work in many movies on e-commerce side a product can be ordered by many customers or a customer can order many products these kind of things are called many to many relationships in database language let's see in this video how we can implement the same in our systems So this is my service studio. I'm inside a reactive web application. Here I have two entities, customer and product. So I'm going to pick up the second scenario of e-commerce site where customers can order multiple products and these products can also be ordered by multiple customers. So if you see the attributes, it's the same usuals I always use in my videos. So to establish the many-to-many uh, -many relationship, we need to have an intermediate table in between these two. Uh, in, I think, logical sense also, it's usually called order. Okay, so in e-commerce sense, it will be an order. So order is the one that brings customers and products together to have many-to-many -many relationship. Now, order table can have more things in it. For example, quantity in it and maybe date of order, order date. Next, we will go to the ER diagram here, entity diagram. We bring customer on one side, order in between, and products just to align them logically as possible. Customers will place orders and orders will be for a specific product. And that's how we establish many to many relationship. Next, if you go to the main flow editor, you can drag and drop the order entity to create the listing and detail screen. Where we can see the list of orders and as well as a form where we can add or edit a new order. So orders are here. You will notice it has data from customer and product coming from another table. Uh, Feel free to you know view all these queries here. It can show you how the curing is done, as well as what we have now is the detail page, where now we have additional drop downs for uh, customer and product. You can use a widget to move around things, but it still has all these queries to make it work. Uh, that's it. Let me publish it and see how it works. All right, so it's published. Let's launch it. There are no orders as of now. How about we create a new one? Quantity maybe 100 or 1000. Uh, date, I didn't make mandatory, or you can auto calculate this from today's date in the query. You can see in customer, all the customers are here. And in the product, all the products are here. And you can save it. So our first order is created. Many to many relationship. Thanks for watching.